Hello everyone. In today's video, I'm going to share one of the interesting tricks that I have been using it now to increase my search ranking. And you can see my Google search console. I have already seen a surge in my traffic and it's a very easy trick. And I'm using ChatGPT. I'm not getting ChatGPT to write the article, but this trick is a bit different. So I have a ChatGPT. I have a free tool, which I found out related to keyword research. I'm using both of them. I'm now using some of the SEO techniques techniques which is helping me in improving my website ranking so without wasting much of the time let's jump on to some of the practical examples on how i have been using it so this is my search console as i have been openly sharing it with everyone and uh, this is one of my website deepavali seo tips where i have been doing a lot of uh, articles around around seo so you can check out that website however what i wanted to share is that once you go to your search console once your website starts getting crawled you go to your full report and you will see how many clicks it is happening etc etc now what happens is like some of the pages might be ranking higher so in the pages section you would go and i have hidden some of my top pages when you go to the pages you will see there are a lot of pages having a so you can see in the pages what are the number of clicks and the impression however if you see there is one blog post where the impressions are very high but the clicks are low now what i did i just selected it and then you can see this page has an average position of 14 and if you go to queries there will be a lot of keywords you will find it out so the keywords will be hidden but you will see that the for some of the keywords the impression is say 1442 but the clicks are only 59 now what you can do is you can enable all these four parameters and then we can see much more data where you will see the ctr and the average position some of them are very good but there are thousand keywords in this and it is very difficult to check whether these keywords are there in your blog post and that is one of the manual seo that i used to do it where i have to check it using some excel some of the vlookups etc but what i found is one of the interesting tool which is a keyword insights tool and in this you can put your web url and one of the excel and they have given the steps as well so the steps basically is to extract the list of uh, all the keywords so within the export button i can download it as an excel i have downloaded the data now what it says is uh, just to export as an excel or csv and then upload it now let's do the magic on what it says so what i did i just exported it as an excel and i have put my target url i'll click on get result button now what this tool is giving me it's a free tool it is giving me top 20 keywords and it is saying that uh, how many times my keyword has been mentioned in the blog post so say one keyword was adsense it is mentioned 241 times and it has a high density but the clicks are zero impressions are uh, 145 only and its average position is 66 so i'm not that much bothered now what i can do is i can download this data in an excel or a csv so i will just download this data now i have a, another set of a download now in this download what i will do is i will enable editing and then i will go to the position data filter i'll filter it and i will put a position from say i i don't want to manipulate my position until 10 so i will say number filter greater than say 7 i want to improve the ranking so i will put in 7 and then i will sort from largest to smallest i don't want to improve all the 90s and 80s they won't be improving much so you can say till 40 you want or 50 so from 40 to 50 take the, all the keywords just copy it now go to chat gbt and you need to put this prompt so one more thing before taking the list of the keyword i need to check whether there is a mention of the, those keywords in my blog article or not so you can see there are couple which has a mention but uh, i want to only target the zero ones so i will just filter it with zero and then you can take from whichever ranking you want to do it i will currently take it from say 50s or 40s only so i will just take those keywords which are not at present in my article so that list will be filtered in and i will have a set of a keyword that i can now target easily so that is the aim 
I'll take those keywords. I'll go to chat GBT. I'll say I have written this blog post and uh, and put the blog post details and then say, please, can you rewrite the article to ensure these keywords are also present in that article and the chat GBT will rewrite it for you. So let's try for this one. So what I said to chat GBT is I have provided the list of the keywords and uh, I have provided the article. I have just copy pasted it. I have to give two, three prompts and then chat GBT has written me an updated article. Now I have to read it. I have to amend it. And that is then once those article details is known to me, I will update my existing article. So this is a very simple technique that I have started to use and I'm using Using this free website keyword analyzer tool now a lot and this is helping me in increasing my website ranking as you can see anyways and this is helping uh, in changing my rankings for few of the keywords i hope this tool will help you i hope this trick will help you in boosting your website ranking and do comment in any of the problems you are facing around it and i'll try to help you out i hope this video will be helpful to you all. so please do press the like button and do subscribe to my channel and share it with your blogger friends if this trick or this website is helpful to you thank you